This was a good result, and I'm very happy for the guys that played in the game because some of those guys don't always see the field. Some of them don't even travel. And uh, we trusted uh, our reserves. We brought them here to play. We didn't brought them here to sit. We knew there'd be situations like this where we would need them. And uh, we went with some guys that, you know, frankly haven't highlighted, haven't, um, haven't played much. Some guys that have. So I thought it was the right mix. And uh, in the end, I thought, you know, everybody performed like we hoped they would. And, you know, I'm happy for, for guys like, uh, you know, Michael Nanshoff, who hasn't played at all and has been very good every day in training. Uh, he's been very good in the reserve games, and he gets a chance tonight. And he, his first goal was probably what, what opened, opened up the game, and, and that, was a, that was a critical goal early in the game. You know, him in particular, you know, it was a great, great thing for someone like him to be able to get that goal and, and uh, get rewarded for all the hard work that he's done because this is a, this is a team, and our team isn't 1-11, to 11, it's 1-30. It's to 30. And uh, I thought that showed tonight. Feels good, you know. Um, I've had a lot of unfortunate circumstances sometimes, injuries and that kind of thing, and not finding my way into the lineup. But when given the chance, you got to take advantage of it. And it felt great to score my first goal, especially in front of the Timbers Army. It was pretty special. A loose ball, um, I believe, off a header or deflection of some type that bounced once. And lucky, I was lucky enough to pounce on it and hit it back post. Free kick, um, I told Freddie to go back post because I know one of his specialties is his aerial game. Um, I'm not sure if he was too happy. I was telling him to get in the box because he was so tired, but he did an incredible job getting on the end of it, crossing it to Jack for the goal. Yeah, you know, definitely playing defense. I don't get as many chances, but today uh, put back in the middle of midfield. And so tried to pick my moments about going forward. And obviously on set pieces, that's one of the, the opportunities. So yeah, it definitely felt good to get that second goal and put us in a good position uh, towards the end of the game. <laughs> I think you saw that our, our team was very uh, um, focused and hungry. And uh, I guess they were so hungry, they were trying to tackle everybody, even their coach on the sideline. Um, but uh, yeah, I don't know. I just, he came out of bounds and tried to jump it, but um, my legs aren't as nimble as they used to be. <laughs> I was hoping you guys were going to ask that. Um, due to all the years that he's tormented me, um, it, was, it was pretty awesome to be able to get back at him. <laughs> um, I hope his knees are OK, but sorry, Caleb. Sorry, I'm not sorry. <laughs> yeah, not as mad at him since he got that, that first goal. He's try, probably trying to get back at me for a lot of years of me yelling at him at Akron. He's going to forgive me on that one, or at least I hope so. We'll, we'll see in the upcoming games if I play or not. <laughs>